SpaceX. They move fast, they make big mistakes, costly ones, but they seem to squeeze by and that happens over and over again. Or are they so established now that we don't have to worry about them suddenly collapsing? On one hand, SpaceX now has resources to put into Starship that it never had before. And so that's really the big change over the last decade when it had to be really scrappy during the Falcon 9 era. So that is one change. Um, but the other change is that, that, you know, Elon Musk, for all of his faults, has been the driving force behind SpaceX's success. I mean, they are pushing hard to eventually send people to Mars because that's what he wants to do. No one is paying SpaceX to do that. So for that vision to, to continue, you need an engaged and, you know, disruptive Elon Musk pushing SpaceX forward. But, you know, his public behavior over the last 18 to 24 months has been more of a distraction. It's making political enemies, I think, faster than, than SpaceX is making rockets at this point. And that's bound to have consequences for SpaceX down the line. It's hard to envision exactly what those will be. But, you know, you don't want to anger half of the U.S. government when you have important contracts with NASA and the Department of Defense. I understand that just two days ago, we had another engine failure and the FAA, again, suspended flights until this is resolved. This is the third time, is it not? Yes, they've had a second stage issue where they lost some Starlink launches. They had a landing failure, which wasn't related to the second stage. But now they've had a second second stage issue um, this weekend when the engine misfired and the rocket entered over the ocean harmlessly, but not where they wanted it to. And, and obviously with some critical missions coming up, including the Europa Clipper launch, you want to be sure you understand what's going on with the second stage. Um, so these are serious issues. I think it's too early to say whether it's quality control. I don't, I mean, the, the second stage is not reused. They have to manufacture these at a very high rate, you know, more than a hundred this year. And so they may be struggling a little bit with that. Um, but we'll have to see what the latest, the latest issue was, was caused by. It's, it's been a while since they've had a run like this. And so I think that there's going to be significant effort inside the company to make sure that they understand exactly what's happening. I would not want to be the engineer at SpaceX, or the vice president or director who's in charge of second stage production. I don't think, I don't think he or she is having a great day. <laughs>